Hayden Banana here. This is Aquarium Rocks. Today I have sad news. One of my fish is near death. I came home earlier and looked in my big tank and seen that one of my red empress males were beaten up pretty badly. So this gave me an idea. Today's topic we're going to be talking about hospital tanks. As you should know, hospital tanks are good to have. In a situation like this, I need a place for my sick fish to heal and rest. So let's take a look at them. As you can see, he has a big gash on the top of his head and on the side of his body. He looks pretty rough. Unfortunately, this used to be one of my prettier fish. And now, I nicknamed him Scar. So what you're looking at is a small 10 gallon tank. I basically had this tank in case something like this happened. Luckily, when I saw that the fish was in bad shape, I could fix it up quickly. So now I have him over here in isolation. I put in stress coat, aquarium salt, and Melifix. These three things will help him heal up nicely. African cichlids are fighters. They're usually able to bounce back after near-death situations like this. But as long as they're around other cichlids, they probably won't make up. One of the things about African cichlids is that they pick on the weak. So if one of them is not doing well, the rest of them will gang up on them. That's why it's important to have a hospital tank so he will be alone. This will give him time to have low stress and a nice healing environment. Think of it kind of like a spa. A spa for the sick. Anyways, if you are keeping fish, it's important to prepare for this situation. Because it will happen. So, that's it for today's video. Please subscribe and stay tuned.